Hello. This is your Norman Glimmerglass reporting for Eddie Evans station. Tonight we have with us Eddie Evans' father. He's going to come into shot now. Ed, uh, Eddie Evans' father, if, please, if you could come into shot, please now. Thank you very much. He's very a bit doddery and very old, and so we're going to in <laughs> we're going to interview him. Could you please say to the camera? I know you're not used to these type of things. Your name, please, is. Uh, hello, I'm Sid Sydney Sydney Everlarge. Sydney, please Ever say to Everlarge, mm. as opposed to Ever mm. Young. <laughs> okay, and um, what's your name, young man? Norman, Norman Glimmerglass. Norman. And yes, I've been with Glimmer, Glimmer what? Glimmerglass. Norman Glimmerglass, and <laughs> I've been with the various uh, stations over the years and various corporations. Co corporations. Sorry, <laughs> what did you say, young man? Various corporations. Mm. And anyway, uh, <laughs> <laughs> is your class Eddie? <laughs> uh, this is this this isn't Eddie. I don't think this is Eddie. This is Sydney. Anyway, Sydney. <coughs> anyway, Sorry, Sydney. Call me Sid. Why are you here tonight uh, on YouTube talking about your son, Eddie Ever Young? Well, actually, now I'm a tramp because what's happened in my life is that I had this son called Eddie, and he, he grew up. He changed his name, you know, to Ever Young. And uh, went out performing in his in his uh, funny gear and uh, I don't know it's just all beyond me <laughs> you got okay. questions for me now well the point is I mean what is the point the point is to be absolutely honest why Sid am I here Sydney the fact is this is that you're <sighs> fu you're right actually funnier you're actually funnier than your son I mean I think uh, I think instead of uh, being a recovering alcoholic uh, what you, are you trying to say? well you could you could have met your you could have made your way on the stage what uh, else? you could have, I mean to be absolutely honest you, my hoodie my hoodie you, you look at stand in the mirror with his brush <laughs> Nothing wrong with standing with your brush, Sydney. Singing along to the Spice Girls. Nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with that at all. What I'm saying is, once this goes out on the old YouTube, uh, the way you look, I mean, you're a cross between Basil from Faulty Towers. Uh, I don't bloody believe it. You're a little bit like him. You've got the moustache of uh, the walrus. And, uh, well, basically, the glasses of, uh, I Norman. think, I, I know, I would have said the chappy. Norman Glumtree, listen. No, no, the chap listen. on the back of the, look, excuse me, I'm doing the interview. I, you, you look awfully like the glasses on the back of the Easy Rider chappy, <coughs> oh, who, who actually ended up putting the axe through the door. Sorry. Anyway, well, the people on YouTube will understand what I'm going on about. The very famous actor with the dark glasses. Anyway. I see. Uh, I, I just going to say something. Yes, of course. I think you're a little bit boring. <laughs> well, are you supposed to be asking me about my son? My son, Eddie. Eddie, what's his second name? Ever Young. He changed his name, you know. To? From Ever... <laughs> ever what? I forgot. I ever Young. Mom. Ever Remember Young. Me? Ever Young. I'm 94, you know. I want to know why you've got a great big sparkler coming out of your left shoulder. Sydney. If you look around, it's <laughs> very, very strange. Anyway, you, you you wanted to be here tonight for the interview, so there we are. Oh, you know this. You're not... I don't know what you're coming here for, because <laughs> I haven't had any chance to say anything yet. Well, now is your time. Three. This is Norman Glimglass, and I'm going to give you three... Oh. Norman Glimglass. Three minutes That's now... That's a strange name, isn't it? Glim... Glim what? Glass. Now it's Glim glass. You've got three minutes now, Sydney, to talk about anything you want to, but including your son. Can I help, please? Can I, uh, I might do, uh, I don't know what I'll do. I might, uh, I might just do a little dance. When the red, red robin comes, bob, 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 
Robin along, eat your heart out, Eddie. When the red, red bobbing comes bob, bob, bobbing along. Oh, 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 sorry about that. Just came more for me. He's a dickhead. <laughs> Norman? Yes, dear? Is that good? Well, I. I was hoping for more, actually. I mean, I was hoping... I don't know what to say. I mean, you've got probably nine minutes. I mean, everything seems to be chucked up to nine minutes on the YouTube. I don't know the second verse. Well, shall we have a little sing-along? Sydney? Can she sing? Shall we sing something? Sing another song, Sydney. Pack up your troubles in your old kit bag and smile. Smile, smile, smile. Uh, while you've a Lucifer to light your fag. Smile, boys, that's the style. Uh, what's the use of a worrying? It never was worthwhile. Back up your troubles in your old kit bag and smile, smile, smile. It's the wrong way to tickle Mary. It's a long way to go. Come on, Sydney. It's a wrong way to tickle Mary. She's the sweetest girl I know without a drawers on. Goodbye. Piccadilly. <laughs> Lest it's a long, long, long way to tickle Mary, but my heart <sighs> lies there. I know a fat old policeman. You'll see him down your way. <sighs> a happy, funny, red-faced man. He's always bright and gay. He's not just like a policeman, he never wears a frown. And everybody says he is the happiest man in town, Sydney! Ha 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 